Hey guys, this is Angel Dallas. Um, I will be starting boot camp in two days. And I've been kind of pushing this to like last minute, but I wanted to make a video for packing for boot camp. So I just wanted to show you everything that I packed and any recommendations or suggestions about certain things. So I have my trusty helmsman here for the Coast Guard and they give us a list of things that we need to pack. And I kind of crossed out all the things I don't really need. I'm not married, so I don't need a wedding band. Um, and I'm not religious, so I don't need, need a Bible or any medallion. Um, some, of, yeah, some of these things I didn't really need. I cut my hair, so I won't have to worry about um, having hair ties or pins or anything like that. So I kind of just crossed out all the, the unnecessary things to me. But um, I have my three white t-shirts. Um, and just letting you guys know, most of the things I got are from Walmart. <laughs> Well, the, those three white t-shirts were like three to five dollars at Walmart. Um, we need six to ten pairs of underwear, white underwear. Uh, navy blue long underwear, I haven't got that yet. But if it's necessary, I'll let you guys know. It's only for October to April that we really need them. And right now it's March, so I'm still debating on if it's really necessary. Um, I have my black watch, my wallet cellular charger and my phone's in my hand razor stationary envelopes because you're going to want to write letters home to your family and friends so i have a little notebook at the bottom right here uh stamps pens things like that i also have um letters Lo body lotion deodorant uh toothbrush toothpaste floss plain black compression shorts i bought two one because they were on sale and you know you never know when you just kind of need two. And then of course, uh, my hygiene products. And then makeup, I did bring a little bag of makeup. So it just has like mascara and um, eyeliner stuff. And then you can also bring a ball earring. So I also have the ball earrings in there for graduation day. And then sports bras was the hardest thing to get because um, you have to get six pairs of sports bras and those are not cheap. Like, you know, they're they're usually like at least fifteen dollars for a pair of sports bras. So to get six, you, you gotta you gotta whip out some money, unfortunately. Um I basically went to multiple different places. The cheapest I found them was one at Walmart and I got them in like a medium and unfortunately they were not the right size. So I had to go up one and there was only one left. So I went to Kohl's and luckily Kohl's had like a bunch of discounts and stuff and you've got if you have a Kohl's card you get like big discounts. So um I liked this brand cuz it was like a front zipper. I really I really love front zipper ones, but this was the only one left too. It seems like everyone's my size and then I basically just got like the same bra times 3 because that was the only thing. Like it's very rare to find white sports bras unfortunately. Um no one wants to work out in white, which I understand. But yeah, so for boot camp, they're basically all gone. And I took every last one of them. So yeah, and then last thing really was like hair gel and shampoo and conditioner, which again, I really don't need, but I just bring some hair grease just in case. Shampoo and conditioner, technically they do give you that. I really don't want to bring a big bottle because I have to be on a plane and I don't want to bring like a bottle of shampoo and conditioner on the plane. So I have like my comb and brush and whatnot. And then my glasses case with glasses cleaner inside and yeah that's basically it so thanks for watching my video hopefully um i'll be able to help out a few people give them advice on whatever they need for when they go to boot camp i would love to answer a lot of people's questions if they do have any just leave them down in the comment section below and thank you for watching and see you guys after i get out <laughs>